first of all, independent of that, I would say the best career advice is be humble and never say that's not my job. Independent of this is what I learned. It's a vertical and there's context to it. What I mean is I couldn't do what I do right now if I've not programmed a PC at any point in time in my life. And it's very hard to come from general and then really learn the basics and understand why does context matter in an industry? Why is a PLC built like that? Why are systems built X, Y, Z in mining or whatever? So I think still the way is to really learn the basics of the industry, learn the challenges, and then I think be open-minded. You could also say apply first principle thinking, like, does it really need to be there that way? Is there other technologies out there? And then skill up specifically on that technology. And I think blood and solar PLC did a great job in kind of killing people up. There is a lot of learning out there. There is universities building, having dual pro degrees right now, because the future will be modern software development. But I think first of all is understand what does it take to automate a thing in the real world, in the factory floor. So to our earlier point. And learn it the hard way. I had my fair share of this as well. And I think because that gives you the context for the rest of your career. And if you are not in a system where you kind of did something until you were 24, and then you stopped learning. I think a paramount for all of us to really push the boundary. So th that's how I would approach it. Always challenge status quo, independent of the size of the technology that you're working on with.